Hi everyone, Dan Gingis here, customer experience speaker, coach, author, and podcaster. And I've had the pleasure of participating in SAP's Sapphire Now event all week digitally. And it has really been amazing. But one thing that stuck out to me today was an announcement that they made about climate change. They introduced a program called Climate 21 that will support customers in pursuing climate related objectives. And it will actually help them understand, analyze, and optimize their carbon footprint of products and operations along the value chain. That's coming from their press release. Now, why is this important to me? Well, I am uh, a believer and fighter for climate change in the first place, but I really believe that climate is a customer experience issue. First of all, many of your customers care about it as an issue. And second of all, though the climate change that is going on has a big chance of affecting customer experience down the road. And so it's something that we have to prepare for. Now, SAP created a really, really cool program that I want to share with you right now. We're going to split the screen and here we go. And this is called Commit. Now, anyone can go to this website. You go to commitwater.com and you can go through this site. Let's get started. And essentially what you're going to do is create your own water bottle that is sustainably sourced. All right, so let's get started. As it says, let's get started. Okay, so there are 235 people in the United States creating bottles right now. I live there too. And uh, what is my first and last name? Well, that, so far these are easy questions. Let's continue. What color are you feeling together today? Let's see, I'm thinking that I'm going to feel black, like a good black water bottle. Ooh, as it turns out, the black water bottle is very popular. 30% of people also chose black. Of course, this is real-time information, which is super cool. How do you prefer to make your decisions, gut instinct or data-driven? Well, I like to be both, but I'll tell you, at the end of the day, gut instinct is going to win. And how has your business previously been more committed to profitability or sustainability? A little tough for me to say as an entrepreneur for only the last year and a half, but uh, I care about both clearly. But since I am uh, very driven by the issue of climate change, I'm going to choose sustainability. And now we're going to watch a video of my bottle being made. And what's so cool about this is that we get to help choose where it's going to be sourced. So for example, I'll choose this first one here and let's watch the robot. This bottle is always on time. Working with SAP solutions to plan delivery time, we can predict and compare the time it takes for a supplier to deliver a material using available data and prior planning experience. That in turn helps us plan more accurately and efficiently and cut our overall inventory carrying costs. So how cool is that? And there's different choices that you can make depending on what it is that you want to focus on in terms of your procurement process. You can go all the way through and, uh, and actually uh, watch how the bottle is made. Due to optimize and you can actually end up ordering your own bottle. You look at the manufacturing piece of it. Uh, you look at the finance piece and the delivery. By the way, these are all real videos. They're at not computer generated. When... And so they also explain the impact of using uh, re reusable water bottles. Uh, normally you would hit it's time to commit and you can order your own bottle at the time. But as a matter of fact, I happen to have one right here that was just sent to me and this thing is super cool so you open this box and the first thing is there's a handwritten card in there you see how my name dan was handwritten on there uh, thank you for attending the conference and a message from uh, sap and then 
this bottle in, of course, a, a recyclable packaging that reminds you to uh, please remember to recycle, of course. Uh, the bottle is super cool. And let's take a close up on this. I got my initials there, DG. And then I've got, let's see if we can do this, Dan's reusable bottle. I commit to two refills. I believe that's a day. Hashtag Sapphire now. And so what's awesome about this is this is a great kind of a giveaway for an event, but it's personalized. When's the last time that you got a water bottle that had your name on it, right? And that was sustainably sourced and that is used to tell a story. Obviously, SAP is trying to tell the story of their Climate 21 program. And I think this was such a neat way to do it. By the way, it does say that a year of refills really makes a difference. 156 plastic bottles can be saved. That's on the back of this card. So nice job to SAP and to the folks at Commit Water. I will be using my Commit Water bottle, and uh, I hope you will go order one as well, too. Go to commitwater.com and order yours today.